Hello and welcome to the Master Soil Engineering. This question is from the fluid mechanics in which we have to calculate the friction pressure loss in a non-circular pipe. The question is shown above which states that a smooth steel duct 450 cross 600 mm in size circulates 0.5 meter cube of water per second. Calculate coefficient of friction of the duct and friction pressure loss in a 100 meter length of duct. First, we will see what is given in the question. Discharge is given as 0.5 meter cube per second. Width of pipe is given as 450 mm or 0.45 meter. Depth of pipe is given as 600 mm or 0.6 meter. Cross sectional area of pipe is given as width into depth, which is equal to 0.27 meter square. Velocity of flow is given as discharge per unit area which is equal to 0.5 divided by 0.27 which is equal to 1.852 meter per second. Perimeter of pipe is given as twice into width plus twice into depth which is equal to 2 into 0.45 plus 2 into 0.6 which is equal to 2.1 meter. Duct diameter of non-circular pipe is given as 4A divided by P which is equal to 4 into 0 0.27 divided by 2.1 which is equal to 0.5143 meter. Length of pipe is given in the question equal to 100 meter. Kinematic viscosity of water is equal to 1 into 10 raised power minus 6 meter square per second. Reynolds number of flow is given as Re is equal to velocity into duct diameter divided by kinematic viscosity. Putting values of V, D and nu, we get the Reynolds number equal to, equal to 952483.6 which is greater than 2000. It means the flow is turbulent. Absolute roughness of steel pipe is equal to 0.045 into 10 raised power minus 3 meter. Relative roughness is given as absolute roughness divided by duct diameter which is equal to 8.75 into 10 raised power minus 5. Using Moody's diagram for relative roughness equal to 8.75 into 10 raised power minus 5 and Reynolds number equal to 952483.6 we get the value of friction factor equal to 0.0133. Head loss due to friction is given as F into L into V square divided by 2GD. Putting values of F, L, V, G and D, we get the head loss due to friction equal to 0.452 meter. Now the pressure loss due to friction is given as P is equal to rho G into HF. Putting values of rho G and HF, we get the pressure loss due to friction equal to 4434.12 Pascal. This represents the procedure how can we calculate the friction pressure loss in a non-circular pipe. Hope you guys learned something from this video and if you find this video helpful, please subscribe to my channel and share this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.